Hello. Hiya. Off to the Bolton Towers and we have friends with us. Yay! John and Rory. <laughs> Let's go. Drive done. We're here. We're here. We're going to the monorail station, but just purely for the bathroom because it does not look it's like the monorail is going. So I guess it's the walk to the park for us. Obviously, if you've seen any of our vlogs, you'll know that I'm Susanna and this is Elliot, but you don't know these people who are Strangers. behind us. We have new friends. Well, they're not new <laughs> friends. They're old friends for us, but they're new friends for you because, you know, apart from anyone that's like my mum that's watching this because she knows them. Turns out monorail's open. Yeah, well, I, I think so. Oh, yeah, there it is. Oh, yay! Also, don't know if I mentioned we're here today and tomorrow, so two days staying in a Premier Inn, not too far. Probably gonna get pizza tonight, which is always great, and a plus of uh, doing a two day trip. The thing is, it's quite a distance for us, so it's not worth coming for just one day. Hey! And there is quite a queue. And we've got the strawberry train, so. I guess we're just going to get in a bay and get in through the doors. We're just waiting for our bay. Woo! And we're in. What's I've, the first one? I have no idea. John, what are we going on first? Right. Yay! <laughs> well, we'll let you know. The frogs are dressed up in the nemesis gear. That's really cool. I don't know if you can see the back of their jackets there with the phalanx. And there's a duck. So last time we came with these guys, we went on this for the first time and it was great. <laughs> and we went on that and our guns worked fine. Yeah, but their ship, their guns didn't work. They were broken, so they got absolutely soaked. So I guess if we go on this, what the that's their chance to um, Revenge. get us back. But um, I'm just hoping they've forgotten. <laughs> yeah. So we're gonna go to Wicker Man because uh, it was closed when they were here last. And yeah, it's same with Oblivion, or that wasn't running. But, yeah, uh, they're the two rides that they've not done out of like the big ones. So, so we're gonna do those. Yeah, and I would love to go on the rapids because obviously when Rumble Rapids closed at the minute, and we just love a rapid. So right, let's go and wicker man. Right, 50 minutes. Let's see. Let's go. So did briefly shut just they had some technical problems but I think they're just running a test now there so I'm hoping that we won't be waiting too long I guess we'll find out in a minute looking super cool I mean obviously the flames have stopped as soon as I've done that but there he is <laughs> There's Rory taking a photo. <laughs> Camera reception. And the ride's open! Yay! Hey. It wasn't that long. Yeah, 10, a couple of minutes. And there's actually people on it this time. Yay! Some little wooden things and John trying not to be in shock. So we can almost see the end of the queue now. We're in the really noisy bit by the chain, but yeah, we should be on here soon. No food from here, so we're really, really close. Thoughts on the Wicker Man? It was really good. I enjoyed it. Yeah. Uh, lot of smoke. It was great. Yeah. Enjoyed? <laughs> I forgot how fast it was. Hey. <laughs> what are your thoughts on the Wicker Man? That was amazing. It was really good. <laughs> good. Yay. Next ride. Rum, not rum, but rapids. Rapids, huh? Yeah. That is literally one of my favourite rides. So I loved it. Loved it. It's fast. It was great. So now, rapid. I'm really excited. I think it's like 30 odd minute wait when we looked. Yeah, the last time I looked, I think it's a 30 or 35. Yeah, so we're going to give that a go. See what happens. It's a nice day. It's sunny. It's warm. I think it's like 19, so. Good. 45 now. That's all right. 45 minutes, not degrees. That would oh, be. Oh, yes, right. I'm <laughs> I would not be alright if it's 45 degrees. No, well, I think we'd live on the rapids I if it was 45 there, degrees. That, <laughs> yeah. The There's a little water fountain. Water, water fountain. fountain. Yeah. Waterfall. Waterfall. Water yeah. 
right oh i'm getting a nice breeze off that and it smells all coolly right rapids let's go <laughs> you excited to raft? Weird pose. Oh yeah. We got Yeah, 25 minutes. Cool. And we're almost there. Lots of gorgeous flowers. And we're heading into the station. So how are we all doing? <laughs> I don't know who got the worst off. I got a massive splash right at the end, but it was dry up until then. Yeah, I've got a wet side, so. I'm like a toothpaste. Yeah. Wet side, dry <laughs> side. Right, I think we're all a little bit hungry, so I think a snack's in order. And then, but I got no again. idea. <laughs> so it says this way to the gloomy woods. And gloomy these woods do look. I don't know what that smoke is. I'm hoping smoke machines, I think smoke machines. This is the Curse of Alton Manor! Yes, it used to be the shooter game, but now it's a creepy dog's house ride and it's winning. Yeah. We should definitely do this. Yes. I'm quite hungry. Five minute wait, let's go. Okay, ignore that, there's a technical problem, so let's get food. Look at that. Forbidden Valley Phalanx facility. They've really gone with the phalanx thing. <laughs> Why? Arcade over there. Huge tank with a well, one wheel that's slightly down. Oh, I guess that's Nemesis. That's Nemesis Subterra there. What's that? That's Subterra. Do you know I've never been on this? Maybe something for us to bear in mind. It says it's closed, but people are yeah. still going on. I don't know. Let's head down and see what food they've got. This is really cool, this like helicopter. Wow. Games there, yeah. Buzzy one, I think, with Nemesis themed uh, prizes. That's quite cool. Oh, and then the Nemesis containment zone. That's cool. Oh, and there it is. Oh, wicked. I can't wait to go on this again. I used to love it, so yeah. I think we're gonna have to go on it. Especially that really design. Oh yeah. Quest for food has taken us to the back of Blaze. Blade? The Blade? I don't know. And down here where they've got some food spots, donuts, a thing with lots of uh, sweet treats. And we're hoping to get something that's more foodie food. Like a hot dog. Yeah. Let you know what's there. So, true to form, we didn't vlog the food before we started eating, but here it is. So I've got Korean, Barbecue, chicken strips, chips. How's oh, your? Sure. I'm just on my chips. Oh. So I had barbecue. Oh, sure. oh, okay. Okie dokie. So, a special guest edition of Let's Rate Our Food. I can't remember the name of the place. Um, heat generated food supplies. I, do you know what? I appreciate that. I mean, I'm not going to show you the box because it's coming in sauce, but it's got like phalanx branding, which is cool. So, bonus points there. <laughs> Tastiness. Go, go, go. That's 7 out of 10, we said, because chicken could be a bit better. Chips are good. But, the sauce aspect, value for money, 7 out of 10 with discount, 5 out of 10 without. It was like... 10 or a person, essentially, with discount. But without, it was like... More. And we all went for three strips. Three strips, basically. Chips um, and then your sauce. And a, and a, and a drink. Um, speed, we gave it 7 out of 10 because it was really, really quick. Yeah, because we were the only people in there, but then the second we started ordering, like a flock of There's people. There's a big arrived. queue. So. so, because this is like the only kind of like quick serve yeah, food area nearby. Sure. Yeah. yeah. So that's probably why. So there you go. So that's all together yeah. with the non discount price that's 14 19 out of possible 30 because we didn't rate it on atmosphere because we we're just on a bench so there you go right i think we're gonna go to nemesis now or the spooky house or the spooky house absolutely gorgeous and it's 30 so it's actually uh, 15 less than when we walked past it a minute ago so yeah let's do it
I don't think we're actually gonna go here, but that is cool. Thanks, <laughs> that's it, that's just the right. Just like that. Neat. Ooh, secret weapon. This is all really, really cool. Okay, here it goes. already but we'll give it a bash see what happens might feel queasy this looks intense <laughs> it should be good potentially looking at front row just that little bit less queasy on there for some reason i don't know why it just looks so intense so good but so intense i'm really excited the ride station is really cool so awesome. And you can see these like, I guess, phones as well. Whoa. <laughs> it's so intense. It's so intense. Unfortunately, we weren't able to wait for the front row. And um, yeah, the main reason I like going on the front row is you, you can see where you're going. It's less disorientating. Yeah. When you sit in front of the back, you're like, oh, there's a big upside down. Yeah. And when you <laughs> suffer with like motion sickness, that's it's it's not ideal but it's still worth doing like and yeah <laughs> it's awesome. it is so good and then the upside downs took me by surprise because yeah. I was like, oh. <laughs> and yeah it was intense it was fast it was fun it was really good it's really really good really recommend it and it was only like half hour wait as well yeah so which we didn't expect we kind of expected it to be longer yeah, maybe it was longer earlier in the day yeah yeah and it was like an hour to begin with but well here's the best but it was great <laughs> yeah see so all impressed very good but now time for something that's not going to throw us upside down because i don't think i can take it right take two and it's still five minutes for the curse vault manor so let's go so we mentioned earlier last time we did this all of us it was jewel i think i've got a picture of us on that ride i'll put that here uh now different vibe spookier vibe um but yeah i'll be honest it freaks me out a little bit but um you know what i've done it before i can do it again cool there's just like a grave digger guy that's fun it's ice cream time we got black vanilla i have strawberry we're gonna eat these. I was gonna get mint, but they don't have any. Yeah, right, taste test. Oh, bang. Ooh. <laughs> Just tastes like vanilla. Very good. And how's yours? Really good. Kind of tastes um, like yakko. A little. So that ice cream was delicious. What I will say is that food colouring that's in there is strong. John's shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Ruined it. <laughs> but it was really, really delicious. Really, really good. So, take that what you will. It's tasty, but not for a mucky pub. There's baby duckies. <gasps> oh! Oh, there are as well. Look at them! And there's some people. So ice cream, we all thought that was really, really tasty. I yeah. think I'd even give that like an eight or a nine. Yeah. Tasty. Really Yours was delicious. Mine was like a really nice vanilla. Oh, it's loud here, isn't it? Smiler. So tastiness, we're giving it a high score, like an eight or a nine. Yeah, it's really good. Speed, I mean, it's ice cream. Obviously quick. Um, and yeah, there's value for money. a few people in the queue ahead of us though, so. Yeah. And then we lost. Quite popular. Hey, we have not lost. 
Roaring Jump. So value for money, that was like 3.75 for that ice cream. You get a decent portion. So I think we're going for about seven. Yeah, so out of the 20, I think that's really quite, scoring quite well. You're yeah. getting like a 16 there. 15 or a 16, so good. Anyway, it's time to go in oblivion. Which I'm very excited for. John's never been before. This is one of my favourite rides. Yeah, Quite one of mine and all. Short and sweet. We love it. Good old lift hill there. I love how early 2000s these screens are. It pleases me every time. Right, John, share your thoughts. It was great. Hey. Short, amazing. Lovely jubbly. Yeah, love it. And now we're in the arcade. Pretty much the only ride that doesn't exit through a gift shop. And I think Rory and Elliot are just looking at our photo. Um, and in every photo, the best thing is John's just got the biggest smile. He's so happy. So, you know, thumbs up. I don't know what we're going to go on next, but I'll let you know. Time for the scariest right here. Gangster Granny. This, again, it wasn't here when we came all together. Yeah, so, think. no, so we're going to do it. It's like a 15 minute wait. The park closes at six, it's now quarter to five. So I think if we do this, then we'll still have time to do one more decent sized ride um, before home time. Look at them. Three lads living their best lives. Queen Jiggly Lillibum. Quicker. <laughs> um, I'm Queen Smelly McDuck, if you were wondering. Hey, what a ride! <laughs> they love that one, that's good. Yeah, honestly, it's one of those, it's just like a little cute one, and it's a really short wait time as well. Yeah, like if you can go on minutes. it. Yeah, if you can go on it like that, then it's so worth doing just because it's really just funny and fun. And we like a funny and fun ride. A nice little light-hearted bit and bob. Anyway, so we're going to head round to Rita and 13 and see if we can do one of those. Or both. Or both, maybe, if we're not pushing our luck. Um, I think if we do, we've got an hour till park closing, so if we do 13 first, we might be able to squeeze in Rita afterwards because Rita has a longer queue and as long as we get in the queue before park closed we should be able to ride so we'll see how it goes that's kind of what we're thinking um it would be really great if we could just get those done today because then tomorrow we can just redo favorites smiler we'd have to do, do smiler do galactica and yeah, smiler, yeah. Tomorrow. yeah but we'll see what we managed to do today it's gorgeous Gorgeous really nice weather, though, well, really nice and sunny. Um, part of the reason why we came this time of year is because it does get late, um, just get darker later, and especially like driving around where we're not familiar, it's always nicer in the day. Yeah. And plus, just longer and days are nice always great. Up here in nicer weather instead of coming yeah. up with coats and hoodies. Coats and hoodies, yeah, which we don't want. Layers. So let's go and see what we ride. In we go to the dark forest. The noise. Oh, spooky. So we just walked past the standby queue and there's literally like no one in it for Rita. So it says half an hour, but I don't know. Do I think it will be that? It's half an hour for this, 35 for 13. It is possible we'll be, we'll be doing both. So that would be, would be great. So the posted wait time was half an hour. And we're literally coming up here now. Walkie, walkie, walkie. And we're basically doing a straight to the ride platform. So this is really not half an hour. Like we're walking on this. So I wonder if they put up the wait times late. I don't know. I don't come here often enough to know if this is like a common occurrence. But yeah, this is amazing. Oh. <laughs> oh. 
great. That was great. It was the best ride in 2005. 2005, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we need to point the sign up. <laughs> the sign needs to Yeah, I'll show you the sign. Route to name best ride ever in 2005. So, 13 time, it's half an hour wait. We'll see. Ooh. Oh, there it is, there it is. Rita also said half an hour, and that was 10 minutes. Yeah, so. Including just like. Going on the ride, off the ride looking at our photos, and taking photos of the sign that's probably in the thumbnail. Um, so we're gonna go on 13. I have no idea how long this wait's gonna be because it says half an hour. But can you trust that? Um, what's the time now? It's 20 past five. 20 past five. So we'll let you know. If we're off at like 10 minutes. to six, then yeah. But if uh, who knows? Who knows? I mean, I cannot see. Oh, I can see people walking. So that doesn't help me. But I love this one. I love the surprise element on this ride. I won't spoil it if you haven't been on this because. Yeah, okay, this might actually be half an hour. Yeah. But anyway, it's a great ride, let's do it. So much for half an hour, we've just been told it's gonna be 50 minutes. Oh well, we're in now. Yeah, so this will probably be the last ride of the day. It's moving. The last ride of the day. Um, and do you know what? 50 minutes, not actually that bad. Yeah, I guess over an hour or something. Exactly, so let's do it. We're about to put you away into the little boothy thing it is. 26. 26 so according to the posted weight we should be on in nine minutes according to the over the tannoy weight we should be on in 29 minutes. 29 minutes we'll let you know how that turned out um I'd, I'd, I'd guess maybe about 15 minutes. I'm gonna guess something like that yeah so um we're gonna put you away but um really excited for this ride and also excited to go to the hotel and have pizza yes. and also look at some merch on the way out because oh, you yeah. know exit, exit the through the gift shop yeah oh what fun that was really good right there's like four minutes until the park closes so um i think that's it for us um but i do want to go to the shop oh, it's so much fun so much fun oh, they're gonna run and see if they can do anything else um there were all aspects like there were aspects of that ride that i think all of us forgot <laughs> i'd forgotten about like how big the first bit was john yeah, forgot same. the surprise bit yeah. <laughs> it's great so much fun yeah let's see what else we can do i love how like green this park is just all the greenery and trees the only problem is that if you have hay fever it can be interesting and make you sneezy but hey or if the you prettiness don't like walking, is walking yeah matter. Because I don't think we said um, that it, we waited just over half an hour, so the posted time was exactly it, and then they, yeah. But as we were leaving, they literally called cleaning. Yeah, it must have literally been someone on our, our track or the track behind us, maybe. Yeah, so not ideal, lucky. not ideal at all. But um, fortunately for us, we were kind of off by then. So, um, so we've been lucky with all the rides. The only one that so we had like a bit of bad luck with was Wicker Man. Wicker Man with the, the breakdown midway yeah. through the ride. But it was fairly quick, and then, yeah. as you said as well, that it jumped up by like 25 30 minutes after we got off the ride. So yeah. 75 minute wait time. Exactly. So we really did quite well. We're meant to have nicer weather tomorrow, which I'm quite happy about. Definitely going to need, need our sun cream again. Um, but the plan now is shop, order the pizza, pick up the pizza, go to the Premier Inn. We've picked up some beers and supplies and we're just going to have a nice chill evening there before tomorrow morning we do this again. And of course exiting via the gift shop. Lots of stuff for the ride, Katanga Canyon, Black Hole if you remember the old rides. They've got stuff for oh, the flume. They've um, yeah, they've got like one of these for pretty much. We've seen them for um, Wicker Man and 13. That's quite cool. And these jumpers, they're cool. Smiler. Whoa, this tie-dye is crazy. Wow. Oh, corkscrew. Proper throwback. They've got really cool hats. All 15 pounds. So if you know you're here and it's sunny and you think oh I could do with a hat. So it was a bit of a shame there was no Nemesis stuff in that main gift shop. Um, there was like one cup but I kind of really want to look at all the properties.
shop and stuff. So that's the plan for tomorrow to have a look in that shop. Now I've just got to find the car. Yeah. <laughs> I think we're over in to see. Good luck, us. Okie dokie. So we're in the room. It's a very standard premiere in. Um, we are in the. Staffordshire Nor Spitfire, Nor Spitfire yeah, which normally we stay in the Hurricane, that's just literally opposite. And it's, yeah, really simple. We've got this little benchy area, double bed, door, and I'll show you the bathroom because we've done something, um, <laughs> yeah, we've improvised there. Um, but yeah, and um, nice telly as well. Uh, plug points. We have got plug point there on my side. There's also plugs here by the tea and coffee making facilities. As you can see, we've also got our food. We've got some lovely dominoes here. A fan in case it gets hot. There is no plug Elliot's side, but that's fine. We can make do. Spare pillow, some towels, a mirror, all some coat hangers. Uh, more plugs and a hairdryer. Elliot, not included yeah. with every room. Toilet, sink, nice area, another big mirror, and the bath, <laughs> which we're using as a beer fridge. And normal Coke. And fridge. normal Coke fridge. Can I just point out that a lot of that is soft drinks, that is not all beers, and there are four of us. So we're going to have some of these, some pizza, and. Um, Chicken strips. Yeah. So let's go eat. So before we dig in, here is what we've got. One pepperoni. There we go. Our, Our classic. One mighty meaty. meaty. Two chicken strips. Both the same, so we'll just show you the one. Whoa, that's a lot of strips. It said seven, but two, four, one, six. Okay, seven. Strips. There's and... more than seven. And then the pizza dough balls. I'm going to have the biggest one. Fortune and Rory come back. So, yeah, we're happy with our food. Looking forward to it. I love it. And yeah. Yeah, should we go? Okie dokie, makeup's off. I never have makeup on. Yeah, and we were in Jim Jams. Uh, it was a really great day. Um, really, really good fun. Yeah, it was wicked. We were saying we've done pretty much. All of the big rides other than Galactica and Smiler today. Yeah. So they're going to be first on the list tomorrow, yeah. I reckon. You want to go on Spinball? Yeah, because you're not the biggest fan of that, but Rory will go on it with me. So. Yeah. And then the, the, the train as well, we've got to do that tomorrow. Yes. And then maybe wow. Battle Galleons, and then like, I think that's kind of everything done, really. Yeah. So thank you for watching. There will be <laughs> another vlog of day two coming next week so subscribe for that if you like this like it there's more on towers yes um we go to a lot of theme parks so you know there'll be other theme park vlogs um but yeah stick about for the next half of this trip bye